Furthermore, I argued in 2014 that it made eminently good sense not to continue to push to bring Ukraine into NATO because the end result is that Ukraine would be destroyed and Ukraine is being destroyed. So I was deeply interested at the time in making sure that that didn't happen for the good of the Ukrainians, not to mention because stability in Europe is a net positive for almost everybody involved. But people did not listen to me then either. How did nuclear weapons change the calculus of offensive realism because of mutually assured destruction? I mean, it's not just military might. It's just so destructive that you basically can't use nuclear weapons unless you want complete destruction. 